Hey guys, hope you're well. You're back with Rob. Uh, it's Bromsgrove again today. We haven't gone far since the last one, but it's the FA Cup and we know how important that's going to be. See you in a second. Okay guys, here we are. As I said, we haven't gone far. We won that first game of the season, didn't we? Emphatically 4-1 against Braintree. Followed it up with a 2-1 win against um, Curzon Ashton. Another game that sort of not that we should win, but you know, I would have been disappointed to, to come away with with anything else. They got the equaliser quite late on, um, and then Sifla Lose pops up with a winner. Ninety third minute, crowd goes wild. I thought it's a great start to the season. A couple of tough games then, more than a couple. Um, Alfreton, Boston, uh, and York, all big sides. You know, um, or I want to say historically, like over the last what 10, 20 years, they're they're, they're big sides down at this level. Um, we were a little bit unfortunate with this one. We went one and up pegged back straight away and we were playing against 10 men uh, and they got the winner in after the 85th minute so I was, I was disappointed with that one to not at least get the draw especially once they went down to 10 played okay um, we just sort of got suckered at the end really so I wasn't too concerned um, and, and more disappointment here Shamabako got us off to a good start course um, one each two one up surrendered the lead again but we were we were on top we were the better team for you know for most of the game really they had their patches and the 95th minute absolute killer um, so two really disappointing losses against big sides, but nothing I was too disappointed about. You know, the, the performances weren't brilliant, but we're coming up against a better, better class of player here. So it, it wasn't anything to sort of worry about for me. Um, and if we look at the sort of season preview, um, you know, you've got Boston up in sixth. Um, you know, obviously a big side. Alfreton down in 15th, but again, you know, I know of them at being a, a sort of a slightly bigger club, so it, it's nothing to, to worry about too much. And the next one against York, as you can see, they're up in fifth. We know York are a big a big team down at, at this level. Um, the manner of the defeat, though, is it was concerning. Five one, we got absolutely pumped. The, the one was a consolation goal right at the end. Picked up loads of yellow cards. Completely lost our heads. Um, and if I'm honest, I don't think I performed particularly well that game either. I think maybe a little bit rigid and a little bit sort of stubborn with the tactic. Probably should have changed it earlier. But there we are. Um, so we need a reaction today because we know how important the FA Cup is. We had a, an OK run last year. Uh, what was it? Third or fourth qualifying round. But it wasn't anything to pull up trees. And I'd really like to, to, to make a go of it. It can make or break it. Or it can at least bring, bring you a couple of years forward financially, I think, if you can have a really good run. Um, we've got an OK draw here. Away from home, unfortunately. But it's against Blythe. I think they're division below now. But again, a side that we've probably all heard of so it's going to be a tough one and we're not in great form um, after those first two games as, as you've seen we've it's unlucky losses but they're losses nonetheless and we're leaking goals so um, training's not been good <laughs> as you can see everyone's heads are down a little bit um, I'm sticking with the, the sort of familiar side the only issue is that, that Sam Alderson is um, is out suspended and we don't really have a right back as we saw last time I am I am one of one of the trialists on each side of a fullback. I, I have offered contracts to, so I'm hoping that they'll come in as a, as a bit of backup there at least. So Mike Peck's going to have to do us a job out there, which isn't his natural position. So um, we might have to do something during the game to to counteract that. But we're going to stick with this for now. It got us through, you know, last season, and I'm hoping that once the lads start to gel a little bit more, um, that we might see the fruits of it. We're scoring goals, okay. You saw against those teams, we're right in it, but just got punched at the end. So. Let's hope for better here. Straight into it. Here we go then, guys. Whilst they're warming up, do check out the channel. Um, Scott's new Valadolid. Valadolid? <laughs> Real Valadolid's uh, save started. Completely different. I'm not sure he's been in Spain before. Certainly not the lower levels. So, um, if anything, turn up and, and listen to him mispronounce a bunch of names. But um, go and check that out. Lovely kit as well. He might mention it once or twice. Here we go into our game then. Big one here. Looks like we started with, with possession, which is nice. Knocking it around, be a little bit patient, just need a run off the ball. Okay, well, it's a little bit too patient now, boys. Can we can we make something? That's it, better. Peck's in loads of room into Bradley takes it early. I wonder if he could have took that into the box there. I feel like he could have done. But okay, decent start. Decent start. Swings the corner in. Barrett! Oh. Hmm. Okay, well... We've started lively, which is good, but let's see how we react to um, to not having the ball for the first time. That's been the problem. Blythe, the one's knocking it around well now. What are we, seven minutes in? Oh, that's far too easy, boys. McNeil, it's the post. 
Really easy then, real soft centre we showed again. Um, we've got away with it, so let's hope that uh, let's hope that we respond. I don't really want to have to be chasing this one. There's been too a little bit too much of that. They've come into it here though. Swings one in. <laughs> Who's that at the back post? Just missed that. That is Peck. I mean, I know he's out of position, but I mean, he is a centre half by trade, so. He should be gobbling those headers up. And he's completely mistimed that look. That's shocking. That's really shocking. And the troubles continue. Um, we knew it was going to be a tough season. We started well, but you know, we've you know, we've been promoted and the the had to bring a lot of players in and, and whatever. So we have to be we have to be patient with it, but I mean <laughs> Great, thanks. But uh, you know, th this is this isn't a team from from our division, frankly. I don't know if they've just gone down or whatever. I feel like they've been in the conference north, but I, I don't know. But this is a, you know we've, we've got to compete here and, and give a good account of ourselves, and we haven't really so far. Well, our attack's broken down from into, from nothing again. Oh, we've we've nicked it there though. Is Row? Come on then, Sif. Can we just deliver? Early ball in. Oh, ah. Close that, not a bad, not a bad effort. Won it in midfield, which was nice to see. I'm, I'm sort of a bit concerned about how easy we've surrendered possession and just let them cut through us. Um, winning the ball higher up like that is is better, but I need to see a little bit more. You know, we're one 0 down here, and we've not created anywhere near enough. Eight shots, one on target. You know, that isn't good enough. It looks like nothing's happening. Well, a fairly poor half really I mean we've conceded a goal from their sort of only real well they've had two chances haven't they they've hit the post and done that which is we've got a better XG but we haven't seen enough from, from us like Dugmore header you know uh, some half chances but we've not we've not done anywhere near enough um, so we need to book our ideas up because it's it's just worryingly passive at the moment we're not getting the ball enough we're not sustaining attacks we're not making any attacks at all. So the attacking players, the you know the the gifted, gifted, <laughs> you know the better technical players aren't aren't on the ball. We're just this is how, this is what's happening, and we're we're not getting stuck in at all. It's a good challenge. Watch it, Barrett. Barrett's on that yellow card that concerns me. Look at look how passive we are. Why are we doing this all of a sudden? They need to liven up. Well, it's more of the same. We need a little bit of luck, I think. We need something to break for us, and, and you know, confidence looks low. Here's Dugmore in a little bit of space, though. Early for, for Bako. Come on, Shammer. Help. Oh, why? Oh, that's so bad. Jeez. Oh, a little bit of promise there, and then we're back to the first half of last season with stuff like that, where we're getting into a decent position and then just snatching at things, and it's silly. Come on, boys. Let's give him a bit of encouragement. Just nothing's happening, is it? That was the one chance, and it was a good one. And we've sort of just snatched at the shot too early. I'm going to need to have a little stop and I need to little, a little look at this. Um, let's bring the bay on. He's not, had, he's not had much of a chance. He scored some, he scored some crackers for us last season. Um... And let's bring on. I'm going to bring Charles on. Let's we'll try something different. Let's get Lelose on over on this right hand side. Um, yeah. Almost like a almost like a two up top there. And let's get Garmston forward. Around uh, around him. We've got to do something, haven't we? Because this it's been it's been really bad. Sorry guys, it's not been a good game at all. I don't really. I mean, if we can. We need to fight back if we can get a result. I don't. I don't really care in in the FA Cup. We just going out of this first hurdle to a. I won't say a kind draw, but you know a winnable tie. It's not like we've got someone, you know, flying in our league or, or from the the conference or whatever. Come on, then from the throw. It's all very tight. We're not moving the ball enough with confidence at all, are we? Look, it's one touch, two touch, three touch, slowing it down. What are you doing? Move for him, boys. Come on. Get across in. 
Doug Moore here. Uh, weird. Penalty! Oh, it could be from nowhere. Is he give it? Yeah, he has. I don't know what that was, but we need a bit of luck. We've got to score it first. It's going to be Doug Moore. He's missed a couple. He's not missed that one, though. Come on, Dougie. Yes. We needed something. We weren't going to score just from normal play by the looks of it. So it looks like Peck's just launched one into the box and a bit of pushing and shoving. Doug Moore does it simple, just smashes it. Love it. Perfect stuff. And hopefully that gives us a bit of a lift. I won't change anything for now. I, I want to. I, I don't need. I don't know if it's. Is it replays at this level? I should probably know by now, but I, I, I never do. It's one of those things. Even when you're at the games in real life, you, everyone asks the question. No one's ever quite sure. Um, but there are some tired legs. Same on their side, but I mean, it's really, really bad on their side. So let's let's give it a change. I am concerned that if it's straight to penalties or something that I, you know, I want. I want those players on. So let's go. Um, I'm going to change. I'm going to pop Mamelu. He can he can play centrally. I'm just going to pop him in. More just more of the same. Just freshness. It, the second half, as poor as it's been, has been all us. Look, you can see the the stats even have, have improved massively. So let's just see if we can give him one last push. Oh no! Oh no! What? What? I mean, <laughs> I don't know what to say there, guys. That's ridiculous. He's absolutely battered one into the top corner. And I think... I think that's us going out, unfortunately. Um, we've sort of got to throw everything at it now, but I think it's too late. It's a cliche, but we've conceded at the worst time there. Um, okay, well, you never know, but I think that could be a really, really disappointing well episode, really. But out of the FA Cup at the first at the first hurdle is is not what I wanted, and the poor form looks like it's going to continue. Come on, boys, we've got a couple of minutes to do something here. Here we've got it though, just a chance. Whipped in, brought down, pass it, hit it. Oh. And the corner's obviously great, yeah. And that's going to be that. Um, or is it? Come on, just create something. Yes! Oh, no! Is he off? Yeah. <laughs> oh, dear me. Well, um... The poor form continues, guys. It's uh, I was looking at that one to bounce back, hence, hence putting it on here, but that's not to be. So we've got some problems. Um, that's what four games on the on the bounce now, where we've we've lost to a late goal again, but we've really not performed there, have we? We've not done anything going forward. Um, no, I'm not giving them any sort of praise for that. The performance wasn't good enough. It might be time to have a little look at those tactics. We've been using them for a long time. You know, pretty much the whole pretty much the whole series, to be fair. Um, so maybe we need to have a maybe we'd have a little rethink and a rejig round there. Um, I don't know. Something we'll have to mess with. Um, not much of a positive to take from that, guys. Out of the FA Cup, which was that's a, that's a bit gutting to be fair, because you know there's it's always the glory shot. It rarely happens. Even if you get win a few games, it's a, sort of a few thousand, it's a drop in the ocean. But you never quite know if you get lucky with that draw and then pull that big team. You, you know you can set set the club up for you know financially for a, a number of years. But um, there we are. Um, I hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> I didn't really, but I hope I hope you're happy seeing the the drama at least and enjoying the series. It is a good one. Um, we'll bounce back, I'm sure. Check out the channel for the for the other saves that I mentioned. Um, like, subscribe, you know, all of that, all of that nonsense. Uh, and we'll catch you next time, hopefully, with some better news. Cheers, guys.